Hi guys, on this video I'm going to show you how you can fix the problem that Steam is unable to sync any game files to the cloud. Now I'm going to show you a couple of different methods that you can try into your system. So if the first method doesn't work for you, try the other ones and to see which one works. Now let's begin. For the first step you want to open your file explorer. In my case I have the folder on my taskbar so I want to click on it. If you have more than one drive, you want to open the drive where you have Steam installed in your system. In my case, it's the D, so I want to double click into it. Now you want to open the folder where you see the program files x86. Inside of here, depending on all the applications that you have installed, you're going to see a lot of folders. In my case, I only have Steam into this disk, so I want to open it. And all the way down, you're going to find the last folder that is called user data. You want to double click into it, and as you can see, everything that is here is mostly cache and junk that you don't really need to have anymore. So what you want to do is to right click into it, and to select delete or what you can do is to select that folder and bring it into your recycle bin now for the second option you want to right click into the start button of windows open your task manager when the task manager is open you're going to find all of the services right here to make it easy for you guys you want to type into the top bar steam and from here what you want to do is to right click into the steam 32-bit version right click into it and to select end task this is going to close Steam and you can restart it once more from your PC and try to see if this problem is fixed. Now we're going to check if the Windows Firewall is making a problem with Steam. For that you want to go into the search bar and you want to type Firewall. Now that you just type it Firewall, you're going to see a couple of different options. The Windows Defender Firewall and the Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security. You want to open the second one. And once the menu window is open, you want to go where you see the Windows Defender Firewall properties. Click on it and a new window is going to pop up. Now, what you want to do here is something only temporary, and you're only going to be doing this, run the game, try to see if the sync problem is solved, and after that, I recommend you guys to set it back on. Now, in the firewall state, you want to click into the expandable menu, and you want to set this into off. Then you want to click into apply and into okay. And like I said before, try to run the game, if it's working or not working. After that, you want to set this back into on something really important for security so i would recommend you guys that you leave it on if the problem is solved or not well now i have two options for you guys one of them is to simply completely uninstall steam delete manually all the files and then try to download and install it again and another one that we can do and another one is to delete manually all the files but leaving the steam apps folder that is where you're going to have all of your games to do that open once more the file explorer and go once again into the folder from Steam. Now you want to select absolute all of the files that you see right here, but you want to unselect the Steam apps folder. Now you can take all of these files, right click into them and to click into delete, or as I say before, to send them into the cycle bin. Now after that, you will need to download once more the Steam installer and reinstall it into the same folder that you have it before. If this didn't help, another solution is to open Steam. You want to go into the top left and go into library. And from here, you want to select that game with one you are having problems. Let's say, for example, Elden Ring, right click into it and click into properties. On this new window, you want to go into the left side where you see installed files, click on there. And in here, you want to click into verify integrity of game files. This is going to try to verify the integrity of all of the files of that game and to repair them if there is any problems. Another thing that you can do right here is to go into your downloads and into the right side you want to click where you see open download settings. Inside of this new window you want to go where you see clear cache. This is going to ask you if you want to clear all your local download and restart Steam, you will need to confirm and you are going to need to log in into Steam again. So don't forget about that. Now, one last option that you can do inside of this small menu is to go into storage and right here on the right side, click into the three dots and you want to click into repair folder. Now, this is going to look all of the games that you have and going to try to repair if any of them are damaged. The last option, of course, that you can do, guys, is to completely uninstall Steam from your PC and manually delete all of the files that you have, including the Steam apps. So I recommend you guys that if you have any safe files, that you want to keep that you back it up into another place let me know in the comments down below which one of these options helped you fix your problem 
Thanks for watching my friends. Don't forget to drop a like into the video if this helped you and to subscribe to the channel for more content like this one. See you guys on the next time. Bye bye. Another one. Another one.